questions. Lisa, hey Lisa, uh, for cats with, um, with a large bone growth around the upper canines, do you remove it if it looks normal on x-ray? The answer is yes, that's periodontal disease. That's bone expansion, that's a surgical extraction where you do a vertical releasing of flat mesial, you take the envelope flap back to the third premolar, you expose all that, you remove it with a diamond football burr or otherwise, extract the tooth, contour the bone, and then clean. So that's how you approach that. Uh, it's just like a regular extraction except for you're removing, removing the bone. And what that tells you, if, that's expansion, if that expansion's there, there's a pocket between the tooth and the bone. Whereas in dogs, if you have a periodontal defect, the pocket's between the gum and the bone. So the bone's expanded out from the tooth root, so there's a big pocket under there. If you've got that expansion, you need to remove it and eliminate the periodontal changes. The other thing that goes with that is the expansion coronally. So as that bone expands, it expands in all directions. So it expands from the apex to the crown too. So when it does, it extrudes that tooth. So that tooth can actually become a malocclusion problem in real cats where the bone expansions happen and that tooth is way out of the socket, may not be loose uh, because of that bone expansion, but way out of the socket is hitting down uh, on the lower or upper hitting on, uh, or lower hitting on the upper, one of the two or both. Uh, so uh, that's kind of how that, how that works.